Well, I'm kind of bored in my shop today. It's ski week or the ski not week. Uh, uh, and I'm thinking, what should I destroy today? Uh, this. Ta da! I think I'm gonna cut this thing up. So, I think I'm gonna use. Oh gosh, which bit? Uh, well, these are both up cut roughing bits. Let me use a down cut. Yes. Three fluted down cut roughing bit. Half inch. Half inch collar. All right, let's hook it up. Let's do the thing. First, I gotta see if it sticks to the vacuum table. Right now, it moves around. All right, I gotta turn on the vacuum. trying to move it. I can't move it. The tape helped seal the vacuum. It's up there. If you bring up a corner, you'll break the vacuum. The tape on the other side seems to help. So you gotta tape it down. So what I ultimately did do is to help this stick to the vacuum table so there's an industrial vacuum that goes through this MDF here and I put some blue tape here along the edges as well as a couple clamps so I can hold this snowboard down to the router table and it uses 14 pounds per square inch so if you've got a vacuum behind this thing right um, uh, pressure at sea level is 14 pounds per square inch so it's like having 14 pounds pushed down on every inch of this snowboard that will hold this down and keep it from moving it's a vacuum clamp basically alright let's go coat it up on the way in uh, to go coat this up I decided I should come out here and decide where I'm going to cut it so I think I'll start here in front of this binding and uh, I'll go in this direction counterclockwise and I want to cut through this binding go up and then back across and maybe you know pull out some in there so uh, I need to do a couple things I need to cut some of these bindings off you know at least there and there so this can clear so obviously can't cut through there like that so this is too tall this might still be too tall here so I'm gonna cut this off like that you can tell that the bit won't hit the cutting length of the bit won't clear all right so I need to measure here on the XY plane uh, you know so I gotta measure from zero zero from here here and then here to there decide where this is and then anyways blah 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 I'm gonna cut it from here go across the binding up and then back over okay okay so I'm saving the code okay so Rachel actually is sequencing the cut because, oh, well, because you know Gerard made the cut <laughs> all right all right I have the G code here I'm gonna go out to the shop <laughs> We're gonna stick it in the machine, yeah. Right here. Yeah. Yeah. And but also, but we gotta cut these off first. We gotta cut these off because they're too high. They're too tall. Okay, cut them off.
Okay. Okay, now that that's done, I think I'm gonna run the code. Ah. timed out right when I got here because the phone and batteries and needing to be plugged in so this is the aftermath it's so this three flute down cut bit right here right was able to cut through a layer of epoxy or whatever it is a layer of wood and uh, a layer of the HDPE which is on the bottom um, so cool yay and random bits of uh, uh, I don't know what kind of plastic that is whatever the binding plastic is made out of bye bye snowboard bye bye <laughs>